welcome to LLT 180, The Heroic Quest. My name is Dr. Joseph Hughes. I am going to be your teacher for this iCourse version of LLT 180, The Heroic Quest. My section, this section of The Heroic Quest, will focus on the literary myth of catabasis, or descent to the underworld and return. Over the course of this semester, we will encounter several texts, each of which has the theme of catabasis as one of its major focuses. By studying the literary myth of catabasis in which a hero descends to an underworld, real or imagined, learns something important, and comes back to share what he's learned, we will find out a lot about our own personalities and the way we interact with others. We will also use the myth of catabasis to underscore our appreciation of two very important parts of Missouri State's public affairs mission. First and most important part is cultural competence. Through the course of our studies of catabatic myth, we will find that the hero goes on a quest for knowledge and the knowledge itself is primarily determined by cultural competence. The hero is trying to assimilate to some larger subset of human experience. And once the um, hero finds this out, the hero further um, displays ethical leadership by sharing the fruits of his labor, the fruits of his journey with the community at large. It's not lost upon me that most of you will be taking this course as a general education class. I understand that means that most of you are taking this class under duress. I understand. I once had to take physics and astronomy, elementary logic, and excursions into mathematics when I was an undergraduate. I was able to get something out of each, and it's my hope that by paying attention to the lectures, reading the subsidiary material available on the course website, um, by reading the text, interacting with the texts, you may hopefully enjoy this class a lot more than you thought you would. You may hopefully even learn something of use to you in your private life as an individual managing your own crises, the events of your own everyday life, and you may also, I hope, learn a great deal more about the implementation of Missouri State's public affairs mission, especially cultural competence, which is not only in the here and now, the different cultures of the here and now, we must also say cultural competence goes back in time because we can't know who we are unless we know who we have been. And again, the materials in this class will also represent the concept of ethical leadership. It is my contention that most great catabatic heroes, after going down to the underworld, after learning what they needed to learn, after making the arduous journey back to everyday life, they do demonstrate ethical leadership by sharing their experiences. I would advise you also to keep ahead with the reading and with the watching of the lectures. By definition, an I-course allows you a lot of time, a lot of latitude to do this class at your own pace. The great majority of people who have waited until the last minute to do the reading, watch the lectures, what have you, they tend to do a lot worse than the students who stay ahead of the reading. Please also keep in mind that there is a website dedicated toward this I, to this ver version of the class, the iCourse version of this class, at cicero.missouristate.edu. Click on the link marked Heroic Quest and you will be taken to this class's web page. It's my hope, finally, that um, you will be enriched by your experiences comparing notes with the ancients and the moderns and the people of everyday life today by examining their approach to cultural competence, by approaching, by examining their approaches to ethical leadership, but more than that, 
by finding out who these people were, what they lived, what was in their hearts, what was in their minds. That to me is the most important part, the most important thing you can get out of a successful experience in LLT 180, the Heroic Quest. Thank you very much and enjoy as best you can.